so I think I got enough groceries. Let's go cook. It's very important, especially when it's uh, from a local market, to clean all your vegetables. Because there's, of course, sand in it or um, other things. So I'm first gonna rinse off the spinach. I have all these great organic um, herbs called from Simply Organic. I'm gonna probably go for rosemary. So, because I'm making two dishes, I'm gonna boil this one first. This is a sweet potato, and they're very tasty and so good for you, and very filling. So, I'm gonna get a big bowl. It doesn't fit in here. So. You can rinse it, but I basically always cook it once like this. So it's gonna cook for a little bit. Some people would say it would be easier if you cook the carrot first. But I wanna stir fry it, so. Snacking in between is good. So keep doing that. So I buy these organic Hunza golden raisins. I'm gonna put some of them in here too. Makes it taste sweet. So this seems good. So I have these pieces of Swiss chard that I cut the, the thing off. I put them in here and I'm gonna make little pockets. This is my lovely sweet potato. And what I do usually, is I cut it open. You see you can peel off the skin, that's when it's good. And you can open it. Look how great I am. I'm gonna take off all the skin. And then I'm gonna mash it. I'm gonna put a little bit of sweet potato. I'm gonna put my carrots and the raisins and the spinach on top. And then what you can do is like, these are small leaves, but you can make a little pocket out of it. Makes it look good, like this. So you can make these wraps. These are small leaves, if they're bigger it's easier. And you can put like a toothpick in it to keep the lettuce wraps together. And you like this. So the fish is very simple. I think scallops have a great taste already. So I just put a little bit of pepper, salt, and I'm gonna cook them right now in the pan. Turn them around. In Holland, we have a lot of local fish. Like we have um, mussels. We have herring that we eat like this when they're uh, smoked. You see the, the scallops they get a little bit of color, so that's nice. Organic applies to beauty in a way that if you eat organic food, your body doesn't need to work as hard to get the chemicals out of your body. So your body, uh, I think, stays younger and healthier longer than if you weren't taking good care of your body. Like if you were smoking, I don't smoke, I, don't, I drink once a while a beer. I like beer. Um, I sleep, I think I, I get a lot of sleep. I don't party as much, but I think if you, you know, have a simple, take those simple things, 
by heart, you look younger and feel younger than when you don't, you know, you don't get enough sleep. And, um, you can always look inside to check. So that's good. Take them off the fire. Just put a little bit of spinach. Spinach is great because you can eat it raw. Um, I like organic beauty products because they're very, usually simple ingredients, no uh, bad preservatives. I'm allergic to a lot of products, unfortunately, and with my in my business, they always put stuff on your face. So when I'm not working, I like to put as little on my face as possible. So I try. I'm always looking for the next new organic cream. I still haven't found my perfect one yet, but um, I think the more pure things you put on your body, the purer you are. So that's my motto. Okay, so I put three scallops on my salad. The other ones I'm gonna leave for later. And I put the edamame. And then I have all these, these, this other kind of vegetable. I like to make my food look good, because then I, it tastes better for some reason. If you go to a restaurant, they put like big piles of food on your, food, on your plate, you're like, but if you go to like a French restaurant, it's like beautiful plated, it tastes better. It's like the eye wants something too. Always keep your fingers like this so you don't cut your own fingers. A little bit of chives. Extra virgin olive oil. The scallops give it a lot of taste. A little pepper. Salt. I like rosemary for some reason, so I usually put it on everything. A little bit. So basically that's my dish. Healthy green salad. Mmm. Gonna make mashed potatoes really look really nice. without even the wraps. And this is like a veg vegetarian meal, but you can also add fish on top. I mean, to make it even look better, I can even put my grilled scallop on top. Ta-da! That looks professional, right? Let me see how this tastes. It's very healthy. I didn't put anything other than the ingredients itself and a little bit of salt and pepper and olive oil and a little bit of rosemary in it. So it's really not bad for you. Oh, this is good bread. So one thing I like to do as a snack, I put goat cheese on my sandwich. I am grilling my, my uh, little piece of bread. I am very curious in finding like natural things to, or organic things to like clean your face or uh, wash your hair with. Like my grandmother washed her hair with beer, so that's what I tried. See if your hair dries out, you put olive oil on. Or um, when, oh, I sometimes have after shoot, my eyes are irritated and swollen. And I put normal cucumber uh, slices on my eyes and the juice I put on my eyes. And it's the only thing, I, I promise you, the only thing that um, suits my eyes. I would say uh, beauty is, is less is more. So I grilled my goat cheese on this thing I bought. And I bought raspberry jam, if you remember. And I put a little bit of jam on top on the warm goat cheese.
the two flavors complement each other. And now I've made a couple of uh, meals. I also bought applesauce and just this alone is already a great dessert. Like this, so with applesauce, cinnamon, organic cinnamon. You can put some raisins in there. And then the dried fruit that I'm also using as my, uh, to go on a plane. And it's a very healthy dessert. Thank you so much for following me today and making some great dishes with me. And I hope to see you next time.